Hello, everybody. This is the Dreamlight Decorista here. Uh, Mickey Mouse and I have been working all week diligently to bring you this festive holiday winter wonderland in the Frosted Heights. Are you ready to give everybody a tour, Mickey? Well, I'm very excited. I, uh, I have been uh, working, as I said, the last week. I haven't been able to do uh, much of the DLC Eternity Isle uh, quests, but uh, I have been taking advantage of the Eternity Isle flora and fauna, such as these uh, gorgeous red fuchsia plants and also these... Uh, blue, purple, silvery uh, little plants that match these frozen trees so well. I was wanting to have hopefully like uh, poinsettias would be nice in the in the star path, although I love all the items. I mean, I'm wearing some of them now. Oh, there's Scar. All right. All right. You're not very Christmas spirit, Scar. But, you know, the Christmas spirit was made for people like you who just have no Christmas spirit at all. You know, I'm here to infuse you with the merriment and joy and giving of the holidays, whether you want it or not. So anyway, I had wanted to use poinsettias, but we didn't have them. So these plants kind of filled in for me. I've punctuated the build uh, quite often with these, but I think it just feels lush and very holiday and seasonal. And um, I think they work really well. Don't you, Mickey? All right, let's show everybody the tour. So we're coming up on this little central location where you can go over the big bridge or you can go through the Christmas tunnel to the other side that has a lot of play things, uh, a skate rink and some rides and an igloo and a cave. I mean, there are so many things over there. I'll show you later. So then we have our little Christmas choir, our little snowman choir. I uh, guess they have beautiful angelic voices. And I uh, got the idea from uh, someone's photos uh, that they showed on Discord or Reddit. I don't remember which one. Um, if this was your uh, bill, please say so in the comments. I'd love to credit you, but I saw the little snowman choir and I knew I had to use it in my Frosted Heights build. So, hey Mickey, let's go across. So now we have the beautiful Nightmare Before Christmas Haunted Mansion. It looks incredible here. It just adds so much festiveness to this area. I love this uh, house skin. It's so gorgeous. Hello, Fairy Godmother. Hello, Vanessa. So now we're going through, I guess everybody's following me down the promenade of our little central plaza of the Frosted Heights. Ooh, look at here. Here is Santa's sleigh. It looks like uh, he's on a little lunch break or coffee break. He and Mrs. Claus came over here to see all the kids and find out what they wanted for the holidays. I have a little thrones right here in front of the wonderful tree in front of Remy's house. And Remy just loves the holidays. He does so well. His restaurant just uh, is uh, filled to the brim with uh, festive people hungry because, you know, giving gifts and all the holiday shopping make you ravenous. Speaking of shopping, we have our holiday market here. Oh, hey, Ursula, you want to buy a holiday trinket? You want to buy a gift for somebody? That would be kind and nice of you. Very different. Um, we have all our little trinkets and gifts, our little ships and snow globes and golden plants, along with our produce and general market items. Uh, fellow content creator, El Serene, she did a lovely Christmas market and uh, she used uh, this pathing, uh, this strewn leaf pathing in her build. And I thought it was just brilliant. Um, so I uh, chose to use it in mine. I do like to mix up the floorings in my build. So it just it feels realistic and a little more interesting. Uh, sometimes the fluidity is better, but other times it's uh, 
works better to truncate it. So I like the transition between the snowy path and that. So thank you, Elle, for giving me that wonderful idea. And your builds are always very inspiring to everybody. All right, Mickey, let's go down the promenade. So lovely. I'm just feeling the spirit. The holiday spirit is channeling through me. Oh, and this one on. Anyway, hello, fairy godmother. How are you doing? I love the little uh, sleigh or sled parked here for the mansion. So let's go back over to the central part where we can enter. I mean, we can enter the other side this way, but I want to enter it the more interesting and beautiful way. Oh, hello, Mother Gothel. Happy holidays. <laughs> I know you don't really deserve it, but goodwill to all, right? And the holidays. Okay, that's enough. Uh, so anyway, let's get moving on. So um, I'm flanked here by the two icy fountains that actually have water. Um, I love these and I love flanking. You know, it's one of my things. You'll hear that a lot. So we're going through the little Christmas tunnel. Come on, Mickey. Oh, you look cute there. I love it. You look so adorable. I should take your picture. Oh, guess who's here again? So anyway, this is in like the kitty area. And we have our little igloo they can play in. There's lots of fun little treasures they can find in there. Our carousel and our lovely train. I was so excited to get this train. I needed something about this skill in this area. And then when I got the train, I was so thrilled and it was perfect. And I'm like, hey, Mickey, I think our build is done. So I just follow the circular path all the way around. I try to make everything kind of circular and meet back up. We have our little well-appointed wishing well, another carriage parking or a sled parking, not carriage. <laughs> and now we come to our beautiful frosted fortress. Um, this build, I kind of modeled after my uh, castle build. Uh, my regular original castle. So I wanted to feel like we were going up like a rocky hill and it was the castle on top. I mean, this build really helps because it is set on a bunch of rocks. So it really looks like high up on the hills. So I wanted to just enforce that. I love these new benches. They're gorgeous. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey, take my picture. Come on. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I can't take pictures sitting down, and neither can you. But, you know, it was a lovely thought. So here we are coming up to the stairs, and then we'll come back down the hill. I'm not going to go inside the fortress because it has not been decorated yet. That would be unsightly. Oh, and I love these new lamps we got. These are just fantastic beautiful. I'm going to use them a lot. Oh, a little seating area, another fountain, the frozen fountain with beautiful views of our little plaza, another snow family. I love snow people. And here we have our lovely ice rink. I'm really excited about this. I thought it was going to be bigger, but I think it's I think it's fantastic. I wish I could go inside it, but, you know, they put up a force field and won't allow us to, like, walk across. That would have been nice, you know. It kind of kills the immersion a little bit, but this is so charming. I love it here by the little Olaf's little cave. Um, just gives it some mystique, you know. I really like that. Come on, Mickey, let's go back here, and then we'll take people back out the front before we do our night tour. Hey, so please. Here we come across the bridge. Oh, yes, and these vases are really incredible. So I was glad to use those. And then we'll walk past the many Christmas trees. I think I used like five Christmas trees in this build. <laughs> ah, we're back 
to the front. So now I would like to take you on the night tour. So uh, sit for a second and I'll be right back and it will be nighttime. See you. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the rest of this video. And again, if you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.